Anthem Blue Cross Blue Shield took over the prescription drug program for New Hampshire's 11,000 retired state employees at the beginning of the year. And critics say it's been a disaster from day one, with some retirees facing extended delays to get crucial medications. And 86% of them depend on this mail order process, statins to anticoagulants. We cannot wait. We're seeing delays. We're seeing non-delivery. They're having to turn to their primary care providers. And it's just a disgrace. Executive Counselor Janet Stevens says the problems are so severe, the state must step in. And I hope that we're going to take immediate action because someone's going to die. Commissioner of Administrative Services Charlie Arlinghouse says his department is working under excessive stress to make things right. This contract and the implementation of it is massively screwed up. And the company that's implementing the new contract is doing a horrible job and it's not getting better fast enough. Governor Chris Sununu says there are high-level meetings ahead with Anthem's corporate leadership. He's assuring counselors the company will face penalties. None of us are defending Anthem. Please understand, none of us are protecting these guys at all. But there's a process and, and a way to do this that focuses on customer service. Counselors are also bringing forward allegations from retirees who say they're being erroneously charged for medication. If that's happening, um, many retirees may not notice. In a statement, Anthem says, quote, our first priority is the retirees and ensuring they receive the care and support they need. We are extremely disappointed in statements that detract from the focus at hand and include alarmist statements that are not accurate. In Concord, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.